This is the Kite Express that I build. It's simple in form, but it has a lot of functionality. I used a 4x4 and heavy duty hinges. It's a pretty simple design. The base is 12 by 24. The bolt travels through the 4x4 and attaches to the base with T-nuts. The top piece of plywood is 12 by 12. The foam is 1 inch by roughly 12 by 12. The pieces of foam are not attached in the event that I want to form a piece of gear that has a flat back. The top is held on with bolts and T-nuts. The top is shimmed with a 3 quarter inch piece of plywood. The foam is from two different sources. The bottom piece is from Texas Knives. It's a little bit denser. The top piece is from Knife Kits. You might want to consider using the same foam for both top and bottom. The only reason I didn't is based on availability. Now I clamp the press to my bench to give it a solid work surface. Now as an example, if you'll look, the firearm is unloaded and I've checked it to verify that it's safe. Now I'm going to set it in the press. I created the base long specifically so that I could have room to put the clamps on without it interfering with the bench. Now all you have to do is add the clamps and you're good to go. Yeah, I do the milking cow thing with my clamps, but it seems to work fine. With the shim being 3 quarter inches, the distance between the top and the bottom is going to be 2 inches. Add the foam into that of 2 inches. That should give me plenty of pressure to create a form that I need. Thanks for taking the time out of your day to watch my videos. I hope to be making more videos in the future. Feel free to subscribe if you like, and I'd like to hear any comments you might have or any suggestions I could do to improve. Thank you.